Guppies are like living jewels. They sparkle and shimmer. Their colors are amazing. These tiny fish come from South America. But now, people all over the world love them. Why are guppies so popular? They are easy to care for. This makes them great pets for beginners. Guppies are also very peaceful. They can live happily with other peaceful fish. But the most captivating thing about guppies is their breeding. Guppies reproduce quickly, and their babies inherit amazing colors and patterns. Breeding guppies is a fascinating hobby. It allows you to witness the wonders of genetics firsthand. Guppies need a comfortable home to thrive. A 10-gallon tank is a good size for a small breeding group. Fill the tank with clean, treated water. The ideal temperature is between 72 and 82 degrees Fahrenheit or 22 to 28 degrees Celsius. Add a filter to keep the water clean. A sponge filter is a safe option for guppy fry. They won't get sucked in. Live plants are also important. They provide shelter for baby guppies and help keep the water clean. Every guppy has genes. These genes determine its traits. This includes its color, fin shape, and even its size. When guppies breed, they pass these genes on to their offspring. Think of it like this. Each parent contributes one set of instructions to their babies. These instructions are written in the language of DNA. Understanding how these instructions combine is the key to predicting the traits of your guppy fry. This is where the fascinating world of genetics comes into play. We can use a simple tool called a Punnett square to predict the possible combinations of genes and their corresponding traits in the offspring. The Punnett square is a handy tool. It helps us visualize how genes combine. Imagine a simple square divided into four sections. Let's say we're looking at the color red. We'll represent the dominant gene for red with a capital R. The recessive gene for no red color will be a lowercase r. If both parents carry the gene for red, represented as R, we place one R and one R on the top and side of the square. Each box in the Punnett square then represents a possible gene combination for their offspring. Section 5. Dominant and Recessive Genes A Colorful Collaboration In our example, the R, red color, is dominant. This means that if a guppy inherits even one R gene, it will display the red color. The R gene is recessive. Two copies of R are needed for a guppy to not show the red color. Our Punnett square reveals that there's a 75% chance of offspring inheriting at least one R gene and displaying the red color. 25% will inherit two R genes and won't have the red color. This interplay of dominant and recessive genes creates a beautiful tapestry of colors and patterns in your guppy tank. It's a testament to the power of genetics in action. Section 6 Beyond the basics, beyond color inheritance. Color is just one of the many traits influenced by guppy genetics. Fin shape is another fascinating aspect. Do you want your guppies to have long flowing tails? Or maybe short fan-shaped ones? Understanding the genetics of fin shape adds another layer of excitement to guppy breeding. It's truly remarkable how these tiny creatures carry such a complex blueprint within their DNA. Remember, breeding for specific traits requires careful selection of parent fish. Look for guppies that already exhibit the desired characteristics you want to see in their offspring. Section 7. Insights from the experts' top tips for breeding success. Maintaining a stable environment is crucial for successful guppy breeding, says Dr. Helen Scales, a marine biologist and author. Sudden changes in water parameters can stress the fish and impact their breeding behavior. Dr. Scales also emphasizes the importance of a varied diet. Providing your guppies with a mix of high-quality flake food, live or frozen foods like brine shrimp, and blanched vegetables ensures they receive all the nutrients they need to breed successfully. Remember these valuable insights from experts like Dr. Scales. Creating a healthy and stimulating environment for your guppies is key to their well-being and successful breeding endeavors. Section 8. Maintaining a Thriving Guppy Community Breeding guppies can be a lot of fun, but it's important to be a responsible guppy owner. This means providing the best care for your fish. Make sure to do regular water changes. This keeps the water clean and healthy. It's also important not to overcrowd your tank. Too many fish in a small space can lead to stress and disease. If you find yourself with more guppies than you can handle, consider finding them good homes. Local fish stores or fellow hobbyists may be happy to adopt your guppy fry. Section 9. Conclusion. 
a rewarding journey of aquatic discovery. Breeding guppies is a journey of discovery. It's a chance to witness the wonders of nature unfold before your eyes. By understanding the basics of genetics and providing a caring environment, you can enjoy the magic of watching new generations of colorful guppies come to life. Remember, every guppy is unique. Each one carries a legacy of genes passed down through generations. So dive into the world of guppy breeding, embrace the challenges and celebrate the rewards of this fascinating hobby. Happy breeding!